We're working developing news now out of Pawtucket, where a multifamily home goes up in flames. It happened just a few hours ago here on Columbine Avenue. So let's get right out to Eyewitness News reporter Marilyn Chera, live on scene with the developing details. A neighbor tells me a second floor window blew out about five feet and he heard a loud boom that sounded like a bomb seconds after the fire started. Now the house is now dark. Several residents are displaced. Fire at a two-family house on Columbine Avenue in Pawtucket Saturday was quickly put out with the help of a resident who the fire chief says unknowingly prevented the fire from spreading. The occupant actually had closed the door to the room, so uh, he kept the fire intact, probably without knowing. Uh, kept it in that one room, the fire was quickly knocked down. Pawtucket Battalion Chief Joseph Murray says the fire broke out in a second floor back bedroom of the two-family yellow house around 3 p.m. Saturday afternoon. When firefighters arrived on the scene, the chief says all the occupants were safely out of the house. On arrival, we had some smoke and fire showing on the second floor. Uh, it was contained to one bedroom. Uh, all occupants were out of the house at the time we, we, we got here. Uh, it was quickly knocked down. Chief Murray says there were no injuries and the cause of the fire is under investigation. Residents were seen gathering on the front porch but didn't want to speak on camera. Now fire officials tell me the second floor residents cannot fire officials tell me the second floor residents cannot go back inside. They're being assisted by the Red Cross. An electrician is checking out the first floor and if it's deemed safe, they will be allowed back in. Reporting live with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Maryland, Shara Eyewitness News.